Hill Foundation for their support for the forum today. And also a big thank you to all the different sponsoring organizations that are participating in this event. Uh, let me just start off by saying that uh, it's great that everybody has come out this morning, but needless to say, rather than getting the voters come to us, we're going to have to start participating and go out to the voters. I know several people have come from precincts walks already today, and I was down in San Pedro when we had about 75 students that were walking precincts down there this morning. So a lot is going on everywhere throughout the city and throughout the region. Have not today learned to take control and influence the initiative process. They have. So when we talk about this initiative process, and I just want to um, highlight what, why I've been kind to working class or minority interests. So in the 1990s, just to give an example, we had um, this initiative process, uh, process brought us Proposition 187, an anti-immigrant measure. It brought us Proposition 2 and 9. Okay, I have no more than 10 minutes. Can someone time me? For every minute that I go over 10, I'm going to donate $100 to AFCON. Okay. All right. What time is it now? Okay, we're going to start right now. Immigrant groups like the Coalition to Defend Immigrant Rights, uh, services, Immigrant Rights and Education Network, or SIREN uh, in San Jose. So there are a lot of different community groups and organizations. Why do we oppose Prop 79? Basically it's because um, we believe that it hurts California's poor um, education system. Um, what is prior authorization? Well, if anybody, what this would do is this would put more drugs, it would take more drugs off the, the Medi-Cal list and actually uh, make you get prior authorization or special permission to take them. And what I'd like to do, and I hope you'll be patient with me, is because redistricting is a little technical, I just want to start off by talking a little bit about how redistricting is done in California and why. Think about it. Okay. A girl is already terrified that she's pregnant. Um, her family is abusive or worse or just won't understand her situation. She's not going, she's not going to be able to go to 